Hi Best Buds, it's Kathy with Kathy's Garden and I'm so happy that you've joined me today. Today is an announcement of another giveaway. Yes, we've almost reached 2,000 subscribers. You guys, I am so appreciative that I have worked on this absolutely yummy prize. So first, let's have our shout out to Gloria, Carol, Juju Bonnie Begin, Nancy N, Shelly Sawart, and Sabin. I appreciate each and every one of you so much that I made you a present. So let's look at what's inside. So it has this yummy pink satin ribbon. And you guys, it's kind of funny, but I made this bag for the journal to fit inside. But the journal is so big, it won't fit inside. <laughs> but it goes with the journal so nicely that I'm going to go ahead and make it a double pair. So let's first look at what's inside of our little yummy bag. Look how pretty. We have butterflies and bling. And we have a little envelope. And we have some lace and some satin ribbon and a little tag. Oh my goodness. So what's inside of this? This is just a little note, isn't that? Pretty, so pretty. It's just a little note inside. It just slips right in. This is embossed. This little envelope has embossing. And inside are supplies. You know I love to give away supplies. And inside of here, we have some very, very nice music papers. So pretty, right? We love music papers. Here is a springtime napkin on book page right here. Oh, that's so pretty on the book page. I have this beautiful coffee dyed and pink dyed paper. Look how pretty this is. One side, it's a light coffee dye, and on this side, it's a light pink with a little bit of the coffee that blended through it. So pretty. And here is some paper. It's a, out of a magazine that is a seed magazine. And so I've just gessoed it and made it so it'd be so nice to make things out of. So that's what is inside of the bag. And then to go along with this beautiful bag, I have this adorable journal. It is so full, I can't believe it. It just kept growing and growing and growing. The little butterfly has the, oh, I always forget what this is called, Ac the accents, the, the, hmm, the something accents on it. Oh my goodness, I can't remember what it's called. The glossy accents right here, and it's got the beautiful pink gems. Uh, Tracy Fox label and some silver floss. And it has some beads right here that I've sewn on and black lace. And oh, I love the dangles. The dangles, there is a butterfly and a heart with some beads. And it has the silver material, the, the, the thread as well so so pretty let's look inside shall we so the front cover has a pocket and inside the pocket we'll find this little booklet it's collaged on the outside and sewn around the edge and inside we have isn't that pretty a pink butterfly with some gems and inside the glassine bag we have some butterflies that have been punched out out of this same beautiful um, it's painted I did it on a gel uh, what's that called a gel plate that's what it's called and there's some beautiful hearts see how they're punched out and then some flowers and that's just in oh it also has some embossing and that just fits inside the glassy bag right here and then inside the pocket there's some stamps here these are all just it just has pink 
and uh, coffee dyed and stamps and the butterflies and the little corner stamp. And then on the back, we have that pretty heart, one of them, and then a nice flip book. So that's what's inside of here. And that fits right inside the front pocket, right there, just like that. Now we have on the first page, we have a corner pocket and some of that toilet paper embossing that we did and I just made a card out of it. And we also made this cluster together. And I just made this, it's a little shaker card that's permanent and a doily and another little cluster. And that's some of that stuff those stamps that we made and I stamped out a, a paper to show you all the stamps that's the paper and then we have this fold out right here that folds out and then inside we have out of that paper that is uh, part of the supply bag I made just a little flip book so that just fits right inside of there and then inside this pocket is the index card that we made together. So that just fits in right like this. There we go. And another little cluster and beautiful pink paper and some tracing paper and some more of our stamping. And then we made this cluster as well. I made it into a side tuck with a very cute little journaling card. And then one of the fold-out envelopes that I've attached to the little flap of the envelope. And some tracing paper, and some more of the stamping paper, and this cute little adorable envelope that's right here on this paper bag, which has inside another one of our pieces of ephemera that we made that is the fold out right here we made it with the napkins and so that just puts right fits right inside our bag and on this side i just made a little tuck spot with a little library card and another cute little cluster I love this cluster. I don't know why it's so simple, but I just love it. We made those together as well. And here's that uh, cluster that we made with the wax, not the wax, the hot glue that goes in the center. I loved making those. And then inside this bag, there's another one of the collaged index cards. And then a little paper, decorative paper clip right here. And it just holds, I'll take this out, isn't that cute? I think that's so cute, it's got bling on both sides. And it holds a beautiful little card that fits right in here. These are both from Roxy's Creations. And so the little paper clip just holds it nicely so it doesn't fall out. And just a little cluster there, some more, I love this paper in here and the tracing paper, and then another one of those clusters, and inside this permanent envelope we have another little booklet, flip book, here. There we are. So sweet, right? And let's just get that tucked right in here, just like that. And this one is also a flip out. It flips this way. And then we have a little tag that's right here. And a little tiny tag that fits inside. So it has a music paper on the back. And it just fits right here like this. And then we have another tiny little tag in the pink. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. I love how that this flips out. So we'll turn the page. We have another beautiful cluster, a little 
butterfly stamp. It's very whimsical, isn't it? Some more of that stamping paper, some tracing paper. I put this little um, cluster right in the center. You can journal all around the edge. And then here we have another little flip with a, another journaling card that fits right inside. I love the way this looks with all the pinks and the browns at the touch of gray. I think that's so pretty. And another one of those hot glue clusters. I just really think they're so cute. And then this is a uh, embossed doily. Can you see the embossing on it? It's very, very elegant. And then I just stack some little tiny envelopes right here with some little tiny journaling cards inside. So turn the page and this is a pocket on the very back and the pocket holds our flip waterfall fabric and then in the pocket in the back we have another one of those pretty little flowers and a little journaling card. Just like that. Oh my goodness, you guys, I loved making this for you. And so this is how you can enter to win this really chunky little journal and the bag of goodies. So what you'll want to do is you'll need to subscribe to my channel. You'll need to give me a thumbs up for this video and answer this one simple question. How long have you been making junk journals? A week, a year, just started. However long it's been, just let me know. That way I can kind of see where we are as a whole group so that I can give you better videos. And oh, you guys, I absolutely appreciate you so very much. And I hope you enter to be able to win and I'll see you in my next video. I'll see you there, guys. Bye now.